Alrighty, YouTube, what is up? So today's this video is just going to be about um, setting up private internet access VPN for your Xbox or your Series X, your Xbox One X, Xbox One S, Xbox Series S, you know, whatever. Okay, um, the only two differences between the Series X, Series S, and the One X, One S is the cable requirements for your ethernet cable so on the xbox series x or series s the newer ones um it has to be a cat 6 ethernet cable or higher it cannot be a cat 5e or higher like the xbox one x and one s now just get a cat 6 cable for the xbox um 1x uh, you're probably going to upgrade to the series x anyways um i don't have the series x yet but the operating system is the same so this will still work for a series x anyways so what you want to do um as you can see right now we've got from private internet access and yes this is my current ip address i am not connected to the vpn I actually uninstalled it as you can see this item does not work as a shortcut anymore because it has been uninstalled because so I want to show you um, just from you know beginning to end how to do this really quickly and uh, just to show you that I'm not connected to Xbox Live I'm gonna go and uh, flip these two over and you see I'm not connected to Xbox Live all right so now we're gonna go back uh, to this display and as you can see right now this is a pretty smoking deal for for three years VPN service at $2.19 a month you pay $79 for three years that is a hell of a deal now you compare that to NordVPN and NordVPN wants you to pay for a two-year plan plus three months free so two years and three months it's $3.71 a month for a two-year plan they don't even offer a three-year plan this is why I select PIAs. It's, 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 it's kind of cheaper than a lot of the other uh, VPN services. And it works just fine. It's easy to use. Anyways, so what we're going to do is, um, I already have an account, but so once you, you know, buy this and whatever, it's just like ordering pizza. You buy it with a credit card, whatever you want to do. Um, you can also use gift cards if you want to be like secret, super secret about your internet connection. Um, I'm going to download 64-bit. I don't know a computer out there that doesn't have a 64-bit operating system these days. Um, so, I'm going to download this. Bada bing, bada bang. Um, I don't have the Series X yet because I am a poor boy. I got too many, too many hobbies that I just can't afford to fund them all. Okay, so I, I have a photo of my login username. So this VPN service gives you a username. And it's like a randomly generated username. And it's just, you know, numbers basically. Okay, and then you can change your password later on if you need to. Um, but yeah. So we're gonna log in, okay? All right, so now that we've got our VPN network adapter downloaded, what we are gonna do is we're gonna go down here to this little thing on the bottom right-hand corner, and we are going to click on our network here. And I'm gonna actually go ahead and move this, this menu over to the side so that you can see what I'm doing because my camera is in the way. So right here, where it says advanced options for your VPN. You're gonna go down to VPN and turn both the roaming and metered network on. And then once you've got that done, you can go ahead and exit out of there. And then what we're gonna do is go back to our settings here. And as you can see, we have two network adapters here. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna select change adapter options. And currently I don't have my VPN on. Um, but what I want to do before I even turn my VPN on is I want to go to properties, I want to go to sharing, and I want to select allow other network users to connect through this computer's internet connection. Okay, and then I'm going to 
share my PC's internet connection to my Xbox just like that and press OK. And you can rename these just by right clicking and pressing rename. So you right, right click and then that's how you get into the properties as well to get into the sharing tab. Okay, so now that we've got that done, we're going to go ahead and exit out of all that. And then we're going to go ahead and connect our VPN. And you will see up here, old IP address. And then once we are connected, our new IP address. Bam. Just like that. Super easy. Super easy. Super easy. Okay. So now we are connected to Las Vegas, I believe. Yep, Las Vegas. And there are so many different connections you can do. You can connect to whatever the hell you want to connect to. You can connect to even South Africa with a 312 millisecond ping. God forbid you want to do that for gaming. No. No, 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 no. But hey, I mean, you can have fun with it, I guess. Anyways, so once you've got all that done, um, and you've got your adapter options here, uh, slide this over to the right a little bit and you can see this is now connected my private internet access connection is connected and then we're gonna go here and go to properties and then go to sharing and then Xbox and press OK and it should connect to the internet but I've done this a couple times so it might not do it um, right away so let's go ahead and try a system restart usually it does it like within 30 seconds it'll connect to xbox live um now i don't know if you can do this with a laptop or not i've seen if you look into it there's some videos on youtube where you can use you get this like this usb to ethernet adapter connection a uh, little cable and it'll actually allow you to use your uh pc or your sorry your your laptop as your vpn source for your xbox um i do have a network adapter like a wireless network adapter that i was thinking about trying to do this with if that is something that you guys are interested in um we can maybe do that at some point but as you can see it hasn't quite connected yet so what i'm going to actually do is restart my console and see if it connects so bear with me for a moment but yeah as i was saying earlier i have a lot of hobbies i don't have like you know enough money to throw all my money into you know every hobby that i have you know i like to shoot guns go four-wheeling i like to build things like you know on my vehicles so uh like i i made a rib bumper and a tire carrier for my jeep um made that myself for like 200 bucks in materials so it's like way cheaper than an expensive one um and like the, the ones you can buy are like a grand, dude. I'm not spending a grand for that, dude. Hell no. I got a hitch receiver in my bumper. I got I got tow hooks. You know, I got D-rings. I got everything I need in my bumper. And it's actually hollow, so I could turn it into a, like an air tank if I wanted to. But yeah, yeah, front bumper with a winch, you know, all that, all that fun stuff. Well, so... I don't know. I'll probably be uploading videos that are just kind of like all over the place. Um, but I do like these techie videos as well because I'm uh, also kind of a... I, I like to consider myself a tech nerd, but I'm pretty stupid when it comes to tech stuff. But anyways. So we restarted the Xbox. It says hi, Dick. And... We are connected to xbox live on the vpn like it there dude pretty easy pretty easy ladies and gentlemen it is that easy to set up a vpn on your xbox now this is with a pc that has two ethernet cards okay two ethernet adapters built into it now some laptops do have two but most of them only have one ethernet connection Anyways, I, I was thinking about using uh, this because I got this little Netgear wireless adapter here. Um, I don't actually have a wireless card in my PC. It, I have a shitload of room in my PC. Another hobby, like I built this PC. Again, another hobby that I, you know, I got bored of that hobby, so I moved on to the Jeep and then spent a bunch of money there, and now I'm 
here. I don't know. That's just that's just how life goes. You get bored of shit and do other things. Anyways, um, so I hope this video helps somebody out. It's it's really quite easy to set up a VPN, and I hope everyone has a good one. Hit that hit that subscribe button for me, will you? Please, please hit that subscribe button. Thank you. And uh, yeah, have a good day, evening, night, morning, whatever. And uh, yeah, peace out.